They're right next to each other, guys. This is the battle of the century. The Mosasaurus versus the Megalodon. I feel like we're watching a Pixar movie. Oh no, Manny, watch out behind you. Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back to Feed and Grow Fish. So guys, today, we're doing something different than we've ever done. And I mentioned it in some other videos that I might do this, and it seemed like you guys liked the idea. So guys, here's the plan. Today, we're going into spectate mode. We're gonna find some fish, and we're gonna follow them around. We're gonna see what they do. We're gonna create some stories. We're gonna name some of the fish. It's gonna be really fun. Plus, I'm really hoping we can get a battle between the new Megalodon and the Mosasaurus. That would just be amazing. So I'm just super excited for this. I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. Like I said, we've never done this before. But guys, before we get started, we gotta set some goals. Guys, last video, we aimed for 10,000 comments. I've never set a comment goal before, but that's what we aim for. And I'm actually recording this video right after the last one. So I haven't seen if you guys hit the goal yet, but I have a feeling you guys did. So for today's video, we're going crazy. We're stepping it up a notch. Guys, 15,000 comments. I don't know if we've ever had 15,000 comments on a video before, but that's the goal for today's video. 15,000 comments. You can say anything you want in the comments. Just keep it clean. Keep it nice. Be nice to each other. And this might require some people who've never commented before to put some in the comments. And another thing, guys. Oh, look at all that food. Dude, we might have already had a battle and missed it. But I can restart the server if I need to. But guys, here's the thing. You can comment multiple times but try not to get like too spammy. Try not to put like a hundred of the same comments, but you can comment multiple times as much as you want. You can respond to other people's comments, but here's what I wanna see. Guys, I really hope you like this, what we're doing today, and I wanna know what fish you wanna see me follow, and guys, I wanna see some stories from you. I want you guys to come up with some great stories for these fish, and you can name them, you can come up with any story you want, and who knows, maybe I'll use it in a video or something, but if that's too much for you, you can just put like your favorite fish, or your favorite number or favorite color you can put anything in the comments and since we're aiming for 15,000 comments why don't we aim for 15,000 likes okay guys now that we got our goal let's uh let's get into it so what do we want to follow first i'm coming up on this mana shrimp okay so guys here's the thing here's the awesome thing about spectate mode dude we can go slow motion if we want watch this slow motion Guys, okay, let's start off by following this mana shrimp. I wasn't planning on this, but I think it'd be great. And look at this, guys. We can change the focus of the camera. Let's focus in on this mana shrimp. Guys, look at this guy. Okay, what are we gonna name him? Okay, we gotta name him Manny. Manny the mana shrimp. Guys, meet Manny. Meet Manny the Manish Shrimp. So guys, something you should know about Manny, he's kind of firecracker. This guy, he gets in a lot of fights. Yeah, sometimes he bites off a little more than he can chew. Sometimes he gets in fights with bigger fish than him, so we just gotta see what happens. Okay, let's take him out of slow motion, and let's just follow him around. Okay, we have, dude, we got a Mahi Mahi around pretty close. We got that cuttlefish back there. Okay, well let's, let's make it a little less blurry. We'll make it all clear. Okay, dude, look at him. He's looking at that mahi-mahi. Oh, no, Manny, don't do it. Don't do it, Manny. Don't go for that mahi-mahi. Okay, he's wide out in the open. Dude, look at this. I feel like we're watching a Pixar movie. Guys, this is crazy. How have we never done this before, guys? We almost have... Oh, is he going for this? He should eat this. <laughs> what is this called, by the way? Oh! It scared me. That cuttlefish came out of nowhere. Oh, <laughs> uh, but yeah, we've done almost 100 feed and grow fish videos, and we've never done this before. Okay, Manny, he sees this pink stuff. Is he going to go for it? I think he's going for it. Okay, there you go. And Manny's pretty strong. He's got to itch his eyeballs a little bit. Uh, Manny's pretty strong. You know, he's got those, he's got those, like, things in the front. I don't even know what you call them, but it's like, it's kind of like boxing gloves. The guy packs a punch. Okay, so Manny, what are we gonna do? What are we gonna do today? We gotta we gotta get in a fight with somebody. Cause he gotta eat. You know, I'm sure he's getting hungry. Dude, this is so amazing. Like when I actually play the game, I can't zoom in or zoom out or anything. Like, look at this. I can zoom out completely so we get a huge view of everything around us. Or I could zoom in a lot. That's really nice. I can go slow motion, like I said. We can affect the focus of the camera. Okay, he's trying to jump up there. Can he do it? Come on, Manny. You can do it. He gave up. 
See, that's another thing about Manny. You know, he kind of, he gets discouraged kind of easily. So he gave up. And you know what? We can learn some lessons. Maybe we're going to learn some lessons through these stories. Like Manny, he gave up there. But I got a feeling if he kept trying, he would have been able to make it to that shelf. That's the thing. You just keep trying and you can accomplish your goals. Dude, something else about Manny, he's very beautiful. <laughs> Look at that green and purple shine. You get him in the sun and he's very beautiful. Oh. He's going around this way. Dude, Manny, are you going to eat anything? Oh, he found some broken star... Uh-oh. <laughs> they just... Oh, there it is. He found some broken starfish pieces. Is he going to eat it? Uh, Manny, where'd you go? Are you going to eat anything? Are you going to do anything? Okay, this seems like a dangerous place to be. Like, <laughs> I think this is where the Mosasaurus and the Megalodon... Hey, there's a Megalodon right there. Manny, what are you doing? There's a Megalodon right there. Okay, I think he's gonna leave us alone. <laughs> he's leaving us alone. Maybe Manny just wanted to take a look at him. Maybe he's trying to make friends with him or something. Okay, um, be careful. And dude, the Megalograptus is around here too. Guys, I seriously feel like it's almost like a documentary or something. It's like we're watching National Geographic and I can control the camera however I want. Dude, this is actually really fun. Okay, I just saw a shadow of a fish. It's the Megalodon. <laughs> <laughs> it's a Megalodon. Okay, keep following Manny. He hasn't eaten anything yet. He's... Oh! Do you think he's going for all that food? Oh, my goodness. If he could do that, Manny would be my absolute hero. Manny, please do it. Okay, he can't swim, but he can go for a little while. That would be so amazing. Oh, no! Manny! Watch out behind you! It's a Megalograptus. Oh, no. And the Megalograptus, he's super powerful. No! Manny! Manny's dead! The Megalograptus just took him out, Manny! Guys, we just lost Manny, and the Megalograptus, he's not even gonna eat his food. Well, Manny, we had a good run. We had a good run, you didn't eat anything, but hey, he had big dreams. He was trying, I really think he was trying to get to this food, but that's another thing we can learn from him. Um, always look out behind you. <laughs> okay, so Manny's done for, guys! I just remembered, I saw in the comments, a lot of people wanted me to find Octavius. So let's start looking around. Let's see if we can find Octavius the octopus. And let's see what he's up to. Guys, I found him. Okay, so he's with his family. And this is Octavius right here. He's kind of lagging behind a little bit, guys. Let's go in slow motion. And let's check out Octavius. So here he is. It's kind of hard to distinguish him from the rest of his family. But guys, this is it. Our friend Octavius. He's got some beautiful blue skin. You know, he's got these dark blue spots on him. The pink on his tentacles. He's definitely a beautiful octopus. But yeah, something about Octavius. He's kind of quiet. You know, he's quiet. He's not really, he doesn't really get in a lot of fights. He tries to keep to himself if he can and just scavenge any food he can find. So guys, let's see what he's up to today. And wow, he's just sitting there. Okay, well, Octavius, you gonna eat some? You're probably hungry. Okay, he's with his family. So let's just keep checking him out. He's pretty, going pretty slow. Dude, look at that. His family's all going out there and he's just sitting still. Okay, here we go. Come on, Octavius, what you gonna do? What you gonna do, guys? It's our friend. Octavius. Okay, well, I'm sure he's hungry. Like, he's gotta eat something. He's gotta eat, like, a starfish or some of that pink stuff. Okay, he found some food. He just went right by the food. What are you doing? Octavius, you're not gonna eat that food? Oh, where is he going? Wow! His family just went up to the surface. Octopus don't need to breathe air, do they? I don't think so. That's really weird. Why are they going up to the surface like that? That's... Oh, they're all going up to the surface. Octavius is going there too. He's kind of he's kind of the last to arrive though. Like I said, he's kind of quiet. He's kind of timid, but he's doing it. And look at that. Dude, you can see his mouth hole on the bottom of him. Okay. Yeah, so they're all going to the surface. That's really weird. Is he going to break water? Look at him through the water. Guys, this is amazing. This is amazing. I haven't watched National Geographic in a while, but now it's kind of making me want to. You know, if anyone from National Geographic is watching, like, if you want, I could make some videos for your channel. Okay, well, guys, let's just keep following Octavius. It looks like he's just hanging out on the surface of the water. That's really beautiful, actually. Look at this guy. Dude, we don't really hang out here much. Oh, my goodness. Dude, I think he sees all that food. He's kind of speeding up. 
I think he sees all that food. If he were smart, he would go and try to eat it. Um, are you smart? Octavius, the food is right there. It's right there. Just go eat it. What are you doing? Like, what could he be going after? <laughs> he's just hanging out on top of the water. I don't know what he's doing, but guys, we got we got to just follow him and see where he goes. Dude, all that food is right there, and he's totally ignoring it. How is this possible? You know, he keeps peeking over the surface of the water. I wonder if he just likes it outside the water. Maybe he wonders what it'd be like to live on land. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe it's like, uh, like a little mermaid kind of thing. He probably wonders what it's like to live on land. It makes sense, you know, if he's underwater his whole life. He's gotta wonder. That's probably what it is. Plus, it is pretty beautiful out here. Look at this view. That is an unbelievable view. That's kind of crazy though when you think about it. It's like a canyon and then right next to it is like glaciers and stuff. Okay guys, he's actually going to the ice area. That's where the whales are. And the giant whale. Guys, if he goes up against the giant whale, giant whale will probably just like swallow him instantly and that thing is dangerous. Yeah, that giant whale, he's pretty aggressive. He pretty much eats anything in sight. I can't believe it, Octavius, He's traveling the whole length of the map. He's gone in a straight line this whole time, I think. Okay, the water just changed color. We're officially in the ice area. There's orcas down there. We got killer whales down there. Um, This isn't very good. This is getting kind of dangerous. Dude, where are you going? He is heading toward that iceberg. Maybe he wants to get up there. Oh my goodness, the narwhals just spawned in. We got narwhals, we got orcas, killer whales. Um, I don't see the giant whale yet. That's good. Dude, as soon as he spawns in, we're dead meat. Oh, he stopped. Octavia stopped. What is he doing? Okay, what is he looking at? Oh my goodness, guys. Look at all those seals. Oh my goodness, I had no idea. Guys, this is actually crazy. I never would have known those seals were there if Octavius didn't come here and show us. That's what he's been trying to do this whole time. He's been trying to show us the seals. Okay, guys, I'm getting chills. I'm absolutely getting chills. He's diving down now. What is he doing? Dude, he's diving down. Now he reached his goal. Now he's diving down. Uh-oh, watch out for that narwhal. Oh, that narwhal's dead. What happened to him? Maybe the orca got him? Octavius is diving down. Now he's just sitting there. Guys, can you believe it? I think he just, oh no! Oh, he's dead. Octavius is dead now. <laughs> the seal ate him. Guys, how ironic is that? He just wanted to show us the seals and his seal came and ate him. Oh, look at his tail. It's like two tails or two fins or something. That's really weird. I didn't know seals were like that. Okay, guys, that was unbelievable. Like I said, I never would have known the seals were up there. If Octavius didn't show us, dude, he went the length of the whole map to show us. He sacrificed his life to show us that. Oh my goodness, Octavius. I'm not gonna cry, but that was an amazing moment. Guys, that was crazy. I'm actually really loving this. Okay, so we followed Manny the Manish Shrimp. We followed Octavius. Now, let's see if we can get a Megalodon versus Mosasaurus battle. Okay, the Megalodon is here. Where's the Mosasaurus? Dude, all that food is there. Megalodon's not even interested. Okay, where's the Mosasaurus? He's probably not even close. Oh, there he is. Okay, well, if the Mosasaurus comes over this way a little bit, I wish I could direct him. <laughs> if he came over this way a little bit, we'd be able to see a battle. Guys, I might need to restart the server because sometimes, like right at the beginning of restarting the server, they'll fight each other. Okay, so they're not really that close to each other, but we could use this time to do some introductions. Okay, let's bring it down. Let's get it in slow motion and let's do some introductions. In this corner, weighing at 455,000 pounds, those numbers may not be accurate, we have the Megalodon, the undefeated, undisputed heavyweight shark of the world with four full rows of teeth, many of them crooked, looks like he needs braces. This giant shark is a force to be reckoned with. And in this corner, weighing at 175, million pounds we have the mosasaurus with one row of straight sharp teeth looks like he had braces when he was younger this is the closest thing in the ocean to a dinosaur you're gonna get his health over 9,000. his damage over 9,000. oh my goodness guys we got a battle let's go in slow motion oh my goodness guys 
Okay, so it looks like the Megalodon's got the advantage right now. He's got him right in the fin. Look at those teeth. Just sinking those teeth into the Mosasaurus. Mosasaurus is pretty ticked. Um, looks like the Megalodon is like going inside of him or something. Guys, put in the comments. Who do you think is going to win? Do you think the Megalodon or the Mosasaurus is going to win? Whoa, he's like pushing him over. He's flipping him over and he's going through him. Guys, what is happening right now? The Mosasaurus is having a hard time. Wow, the Megalodon, is he like... <laughs> the Megalodon went through him. Okay, things are getting kind of crazy. Okay, this Mosasaurus, he's got to turn around. He's got to turn around to get this guy. Okay, let's speed things up a little bit. Okay, we're going a little bit faster, Mosasaurus, please. I'm hoping the Mosasaurus can at least get a bite in. But dude, if he does, if he gets to him... It might be over for the Megalodon. I have a feeling. I don't know how much health or damage they do, but I have a feeling the Mosasaurus does more damage, has more health. Because look at all those teeth. Look at the size of his mouth. Dude, he's so close to getting the Megalodon. But the Megalodon, he just keeps chomping. Okay, so he went, he went like a bunch of bites on this side, and now he's going on this side. He's going back and forth. Dude, look at that bite. Look at his mouth, his jaw. It's almost like his jaw dislocates or something. Okay, dude, he's like going inside of him again. Guys, I don't know if this Mosasaurus stands a chance. Okay, let's go a little bit faster and let's see what happens. Dude, this Mosasaurus, he might not stand a chance. Thing is, like his biggest weakness is his turn. His turn radius is pretty small. Guys, remember when we took him out as a Bebos? Guys, I was a small little Bebos, and I took out the Mo- Dude, look at the Mosasaurus now. Is he dead? Did the Megalodon just beat him? Oh my goodness, dude. I think he just beat him. That is crazy. Okay, we might need to make this a best out of three situation. So, Megalodon, one round one. He demolished him. Whoa! <laughs> oh! Dude, the Mosasaurus just spawned in. Is he coming back for revenge? Guys, he's coming back for revenge. He's going after him. Oh my goodness, dude, he's going after him. And the Megalodon is running away. The Mosasaurus, he's just so slow. Guys, this is like the Super Bowl of aquatic battles. Okay, uh-oh, the Megalodon's coming after him, is he? Oh, maybe they're, uh, maybe they have a truce? The Mosasaurus is going away, but the Megalodon, he's coming after him. Maybe no truce after all. Guys, I would like to see round two. Please tell me. Come on. You're so close to him. This one bite. Okay. He's not biting. Okay, guys. We got round two. They're already going for each other. Okay, let's speed it up. Here we go. And let's watch it in full speed. Okay. Oh, the Mosasaurus. Mosasaurus actually has him this time. Oh, my goodness, guys. I think he's got him. Oh, my goodness, dude. That was... Oh, dude. That was like three bites or something. Oh, this is round three. Guys, round three, we got to go slow motion for this one. This is going to be the championship round. It's one to one. The Megalodon got the first one. Mosasaurus got the second one. Who's going to win the championship round? They're right next to each other, guys. This is the battle of the century. Dude, he's right in front of you. Mosasaurus, go for him. Aren't you going to bite him? Um, he's not going to bite him. Okay, well, I guess they're friends now. <laughs> so it seems like after they get in a battle... Then they become friends. That's actually kind of weird. Okay, guys, here we go. This is it. The championship round. The Mosasaurus versus the Megalodon. Guys, put in the comments who you think is going to win. This is insane. I can't believe what we're watching right now. Guys, this should be like pay-per-view or something. <laughs> oh, no. Dude, the Megalodon, he's got him on the tail. That's not good. Okay, let's speed it up just a little bit. We're going maybe 50% speed. Guys, as soon as the Megalodon gets him on the tail, it's really hard for the Mosasaurus to come around and get him. Guys, look at this. This is so crazy. Man, I am so glad they added this Megalodon, guys. I wish so bad I could play as him. Hopefully, they give us the ability to play as the Megalodon pretty soon, or maybe even the Mosasaurus, that giant whale. Because we can play as a great white shark now. Dude, I think it's over for this Mosasaurus. I think the Megalodon's gonna win it. The Megalodon just won the championship, guys. Congrats if you voted for the Megalodon in the comments. Dude, that's crazy. He's just manhandling him. And he's eating the, eating the food. <laughs> he only ate half of it. Guys, that was crazy. Look at this guy. He won the championship round. He won the best out of three. Okay, well, guys, like I said, this is totally different than all the other videos we've made. But 
I had so much fun doing this. Like, I really hope you guys like it. If you do, if we should do more stuff like this, let me know in the comments. Hopefully, we can hit that 15,000 like goal. And also, guys, if you missed last week's video, we played as the baby Barracuda for the first time. And we made a huge family. And I'll just leave it at this. A lot of things happened that I didn't expect. So definitely check that video out if you missed it. But guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, as always, feel free to hit that thumbs up button. And subscribe if you haven't already. I will see you guys in the next Feed and Grow Fish. Now is the moment of truth. Let's see if this thing is going to explode. Oh! oh, my goodness. It's a punch. It's gone. Oh! It turns everyone into punches. No! No, he got me! I'm popping off. I'm trying to get out. Crazy red shark. Dude, he's going in.